These are the top 10 NFL teams going into week five. At number 10, the Steelers. Their number one ranked defense got exposed against the Colts, but I like what I saw from Justin Fields and their offense showed signs of life in the second half of their game. At number nine, the Seahawks. Even in a loss, they proved they're a good enough team to remain in the top 10, but they need to get some of their starters back healthy on defense. At number eight, the Commanders. Jaden Daniels and company have been putting up video game like numbers offensively. The sky's the limit if this level of QB play continues. At number seven, the Buccaneers. They proved last week's loss to the Broncos was an anomaly. They've got three impressive wins now over the Commanders, Lions, and Eagles. At number six, the Texans. It wasn't pretty, but they got it done against Jacksonville. Good teams find a way to win close games. At number five, the Bills. They were completely humbled and smacked in the mouth by a revived Ravens team. They gotta just scrap the tape and move on to next week. At number four, the Ravens. After looking like they might find themselves in an 0-4 hole, this team's turned it around quickly. Derrick Henry's dominance the past two weeks has been unreal. At number three, the Lions. We finally got to see the full-fledged dynamic Lions offense we're used to from last season. This team can ground and pound and air it out. At number two, the Chiefs. They're 4-0, but it hasn't been very convincing, and they might have just lost their best offensive playmaker for the season. At number one, Skull, the Vikings on top.